there was a hooker standing here. The lesbian slides with knots. Well, actually, you want to be a gay couple? Let's go to one of these construction, new constructions home and get out and fucking... Let's get one that's mostly complete and fucking just ramsack that bitch right quick. Braxton, tell the workers we're the owners and we're there to check on progress. Okay. We're gonna roast these deals, son. Ryan, you ready to roast these deals? I'm not qualified to roast nothing. You can roast corn. I'm not qualified for that either. You just throw it in a fire. When it's done. Yeah, how do you know it's done? It's on fire. Are you qualified now? <laughs> Apparently. Any questions? This is wild. You think we ought to put solar panels on our uh, on our single wads? Well, these houses have to fit in with these neighborhoods. Well, yeah, go left. This one right here looks like a solid one. The guy's in a Camaro. You want to go to one with nobody? Yeah, but these this one's almost done. I mean they're. I want to get one that's mostly done. I don't. We're walking into one that's framed up. Like, yeah, that one's already. Yeah. Keep going or stop? Oh yeah, we're here. We'll stop here. This ain't one of the homes we called though. The, the this is something else. Let's check on the progress of our new home. Braxton, you want to be a gay couple? Yes, sir. Buddy. Proper proper bathroom etiquette. When you use the porta potty, take your shoes off. There was a hooker standing here. Take out the shoes for the Oh my god. Oh, this. <laughs> All right. The lesbian slides of Nas. Obviously been drinking on the job. There's more alcohol in the water bottle there. Y'all should ask him, did y'all dive into why he won't shit in the porta body? spray foam in that thick this is the kitchen small kitchen I feel like yeah it's got some sort of pressure things on it is that for gas it's gotta be gas so Nancy Pelosi is anti this house it's got an island that's gonna have a sink on it. Mm -hmm. That lot of plumbing. Huh? Mm -hmm. Hey. Yeah. Here's a giant pantry. Mm -hmm. Does it? Yeah. Looks like they have a fire pit. So it's good. We gotta have a fire pit. That's got a gas. Be like a studier, whatever you want. It's gonna have amazing entrance. I don't know if that's gonna be a mud room. Yeah, shelves. Set sliding. Tall ceilings too. Very tall ceilings. We get the master here with a seven-person shower. Now, here's where they fucked up. 
You got a seven, eight hundred thousand dollar home, one shower head, no rain can. Like, look at how big this shower is. Come on, Braxton. Two grown men in here right now. With plenty of room. With plenty of room. One shower. One shower head. There's probably some body sprayers down here. They don't even have body sprayers. That's crazy to me. They, this should this have a shower with only. This should have a rain can up top. So one that comes down. It should have his and her shower heads. So she can adjust her heat uh, how she wants it. He can adjust his heat how he wants it. And it should have body sprayers that just fucking blast your ass at every level. Sink. Sink. Tub. Not jacuzzi tub. And then the private toilet so you can be in there doing the, doing the damn thing. If I was at this price point home, I'd have his and her toilets. Now this is kind of interesting. Very wide. What? Yeah, that don't make sense up there. I wonder why they, I guess probably some stupid zoning law. Going on the second floor. Attic access. Doesn't look like they're gonna finish this out. You can see the spray foaming. Like to get a room or something. Look at the spray foam. A lot of it. A lot of it. What is this? Computer room? O like office? I don't know. I mean, it's just kind of a wasted space, I feel like. Anyways, a couple more bedrooms. How many bedrooms do you count downstairs? Three. And then upstairs, we got another three bedrooms, another bathroom here. Own, its own private bath. So it's got a private bath there. This bathroom's for everyone. So what's our bathroom count? We have four bathrooms. But this is just a huge wasted space. I feel like this space is useless. Wait, what is this? Because it's got this little whatever that is. See, yeah, that's what I don't understand. It's like it could have been. This is like such a Space for a bedroom. So you got three rooms upstairs and two bathrooms. You got a three two upstairs. It's like, where do you even, if this is like a dinner or whatever, where's the TV go? You know, like you got some weird big window thing right there with no plug. I don't know what's going on here. So it's like, and then this, this material, this is bullshit material. This is cheap. Hmm. Interesting. Definitely have a price point to that one. Fireplace. So the fireplace, even though it shares this wall, the master, it's not a double fireplace. That's a little wild. Um, the bathroom here. Is that the only bathroom downstairs? Other than the master? That's our closet. Mm. Yeah. So yeah, two bathrooms downstairs. Is there even a half bath? No. That's it. So you just use that bath. Almost seems pointless to have two upstairs. Do they have secondary master bathrooms? Is that a thing, Braxton? I don't think so. Like, because that's a master, essentially a master suite upstairs has its own private bath. It's a little bit smaller. Yeah. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. What you think, Brack? I don't. I don't hate it. We take the price point, yes. I bet you it's about probably about all the same, seven, eight hundred. You have to get the address and keep an eye on this. This might already be sold though. This might be a custom home. Look at that. Golf cart, garage. Where does it go in? Now that is. I knew there wasn't. Huh. So, yeah. Do you think the this is all concrete in the front? Yeah. I don't, I don't think they just put a fire butt or anything in there. I think all of this is concrete. Big driveway. You get your lawnmower, or golf cart, or whatever. Garage. Gas line. Makeshift power.
perfect toss. 